This common yellow throat is a gorgeous example of a mature male of this species. If you were a female common yellow throat, you'd look at that black mask and the lovely gray border around it and think, wow, this guy is a keeper. Or would you? I'm Shane, this is Beaver Hill Bird Observatory, and welcome to Bird Bites. Common yellow throats are one of many passerines that exhibit very low mate fidelity. They have a very high rate of what we refer to as extra pair bonding, which in other words, is just kind of sleeping around. Most females of this species, as well as several other warblers, will actively invite other males to copulate with them, and other males will actively look around for willing females. It's sort of an open acknowledgement that both parties are just going to be wandering around and mixing the gene pool a little bit, and it serves mostly as a hedging strategy. Sure, you can be picky about mate selection to ensure you get superior genetics, but there's no sense leaving anything to chance. Why would you not take as many kicks at the can as possible? And that's the logic behind this sort of reproductive behavior. In many cases, females will time it so that each egg in a nest is sired by a different male. And as far as the males are concerned, they don't particularly mind. Sure, only one of the eggs in the nest is theirs, but they also have eggs in more than one different nest. Since nest failure often tends to be total rather than only a couple not surviving, spreading your eggs around as many nests as possible maximizes the chance that some of them will survive. 